What's up guys, Justin here, and today I've got the review of the Blue Spark digital microphone. You may know about the Blue Spark, which is a microphone I actually use in almost every one of my videos, and the differences are that the standard Blue Spark is an XLR microphone, so you will need an analog to digital converter that you'll have to purchase separately. While the Blue Spark Digital goes by its name, and it is a digital microphone that is USB, and it has plug and play capability. It is also compatible very easily with the iPad, and Blue has included all the cables you needed to do so. So overall this is a great microphone for people who want to travel but still get a very high quality sound, or if you're going to be recording on your iPad. You probably may have heard of or even own a Blue audio product before, such as the Blue Icicle, the Blue Yeti, but they definitely make very good microphones. So let's take a look at the packaging, we're going to open it up, and there's just a piece of literature there, and it also comes with a carry case, which makes this very easy to carry around, and there's also the accessories in there, such as the cable for the iPad, and also the standard USB cable. And the cable that they include also has a zero latency audio jack so you can real time monitor your audio while you're recording which a lot of people like to do. And there's just a packaging itself. So it doesn't come with a separate shock mount and stand but it is more two in one. It has a shock mount built into the stand which is rather adjustable and very easy to use. And here's just the Spark Digital itself, and it looks a lot like the Blue Spark, as you may expect. I really like the design of it, and it's kind of like a capsule microphone. So, they say that this is a studio-grade cardioid condenser microphone, and I have to say it definitely sounds very good. And if you haven't noticed already, I have been using this in this whole video, and it overall sounds pretty good. On the front, you've just got your gain control for your volume, and on the back, you also have a focus on and focus off switch, which is, gives you two signature sounds in one. But for most people, and for me in particular, I just keep it on um, focus off, and it overall sounds very good as you can see here. I haven't done any other editing to it, this is just a raw sound coming from the Blue Spark. Here's just a look at the shock mount itself. It is very useful as sometimes you might knock your stuff around or it might be shaking and you don't want to get that sound or bumping sounds onto your actual audio recording. So the shock mount is rather useful, more useful than you may think. The microphone itself is also very adjustable. With the built-in desk mount stand, it makes it very easy to carry it around with you and very easily adjust it to the angle you may like. And I have to say it's very good for whether you're doing vocals, voiceovers like me, like tech reviews, or if you want to just record an interview, bands, etc. This is a very good all-round microphone. Although the low end is a little bit high, like there's more of a bass to it when you're talking, it still sounds very good and some people may like that. In my opinion, I kind of like that. It gives a much more fuller sound experience to the user. So I have to say there are a lot of good features about the Blue Spark Digital. The overall sound quality is very very good as you may have heard from this video. It has a nice professional sound to it and I'd almost say it's a mix between the Blue Spark and the Yeti or the Snowball line. It has a lot of the features of the entry professional Blue Spark while sharing a lot of the same features with the Yeti and the Snowball as well with its very easy plug and play capability through USB and you can also use it with your iPad which a lot of people may appreciate to use with garage band and the controls are all in front of you very easy to access and really the bottom line is this microphone has all the features you may need and of course a good sound quality which is probably the most important thing about microphones so thanks for watching guys if you're interested in this microphone be sure to check below that like button for the pricing and availability big thanks to blue for sending us out for reviewing purposes and i'll see you all in my next video